I think one of the biggest things I would recommend, um, just as a general motto to follow, is keep an open mind. I know that, like, for me, when I came in, I kind of had an idea of what I wanted to go into um, and, like, expectations I had for just being a freshman and being an undergrad at Purdue. And that really, like, changed throughout the time I was at Purdue. Um, so it's really common for people to, like, change their mind about their major and what field they want to pursue. Um, but in terms of what Purdue does really well with uh, first-year engineering is that you have a year to really explore what you want to do. So, like, having uh, professionals come in and talk about their different areas of expertise, um, going to different clubs and, like, uh, organizational events, that kind of thing is a really good opportunity to explore the different fields that engineering offers. A good thing would be in high school, at least, to take some of the advanced classes in physics and math. So that way, when you come to college, because things at Purdue are harder, it is an engineering college, they are harder, and it would be best if you take the harder classes in school, so you're used to studying in that manner. Because the jump from high school to college is definitely a very steep one. So it's best to take the advanced classes. The other thing is, at before coming into Purdue, you must develop the habit of studying regularly. Is something which I have seen helps a lot. Like you come back from school or your day in college, and then study for three or four hours that day, so you don't have to study at night or stay awake the whole night and not get sleep. For first year content, academic wise, I would say it's good to have a decent understanding of physics, whether that's an entry level class or you've taken an AP class, uh, either is fine. Just having some kind of physics background or knowledge would definitely be helpful for your first year. And some kind of calculus foundation as well, whether that's pre-calc, calc one, whether you're taking an AP calc, but just coming in with some kind of a foundation is very helpful academically. Uh, and then I would say socially, it's just good to know how to work with other people in a team and be comfortable with that kind of a situation. And, you know, again, like, like I said, engineering is very team-based, so being able to work on a team and knowing how to work with people is going to help you in the long run since that's you're going to be doing a lot of labs and that's how um, engineering is going to be done in the field.